So I just found this futuristic car and it's weird because look how smooth it is. It kind of gives me UFO vibes. Is this car from another planet? I have no idea, but we're about to find out. Now, the reason I believe this car to be from another planet is because, look, we don't even have like an interior design. It's kind of weird because we got the outside design going, but then when we come to the inside, everything is like undesigned. It's almost like it was made for an alien to drive. But anyways, like you would imagine, this vehicle is electric. Usually I'm not a fan of electric cars, but this one can be gas or electric. I don't care. I'm still driving it. Hold on. What do we have here? Larry's used RV sales. Mm, I'm not too sure about that. I'd only buy an RV for one reason, and that's if I was selling mefaruni out of it. Uh-oh, we got a cop here. Is he really pulling me over? I didn't even do anything. Now, I know it's kind of hard to see now. I'd imagine at nighttime it looked way nicer. But this car does not have like regular stoplights. You can see we've got tons of little LEDs. I don't even know if they're LEDs. And I also notice at the front of the car, we also have them. I'm not sure why, but I kind of feel like trolling the cops with this futuristic car. I'm gonna take it easy and see what happens. Is this man okay? Hello, sir, can you hear me? No, I think he's dead. You see now this right here is a normal Mercedes and then we've got my one. Come on, you can't say that aliens didn't modify my vehicle. Look, I know that's not the case, but we're gonna, we're gonna run with that story, okay? This is an alien car. Um, this guy's doing a little drift on a helipad. What makes it funny is this is meant to be a hearse. You know, when you die, you get put in the back of one of these cars, but instead he's made it into like a pimped out lowrider type of thing. What you doing, dog? This a helipad. Wait. Do you have a gun license? Don't worry about me. You need to go sort those guys out. Pull over, please. Better yet, how about you catch me? I did say that I want to troll some cops in my futuristic car, so I guess now is the time. For some reason, because I had my pistol out, they wanted to try and arrest me. What about the people drifting on your helipad? Surely that's a bit more important than one guy with a gun. I think I already lost that cop that was trying to pull me over anyway. There seems to be a lot of abandoned cop cars around town. Here's another abandoned cop car. Yeah, see, this is a clear sign that they're not doing their job correctly. <laughs> <laughs> what is this guy doing? Oh no, it's the pimped out hearse. Hey, what's good with you, man? What's good with you? You parking in my driveway like you live. Yeah, bro, you got hella blood on your face. Uh, yep. Um, can you burp somewhere else, maybe? I burp where I want to burp, definitely when I'm at my own house. Well, bro, listen, you're burping in my face. It's a bit rude. Uh, you can leave. Did you eat something? Did, what did you drink? Where did this man's tattoos go? You want to leave? Nah, not really, bro. I'm just posted up here, came to say what's up. You know, I saw you chilling <coughs> all right bro three times is enough i mean I'm, I'm i'm still doing what i want on my property but do you want to leave like can't i be here i came here with my little drink cat i'm trying to enjoy myself what's wrong um what are you doing how did this man pick me up and put me on the sidewalk and now this guy's in my car i'm trying to chill in the driveway with you boys no nah, we all know you man. <laughs> he just picked your ass up <laughs> <laughs> All right, so I sneaked myself back onto the driveway and I don't know why but there's some secret agents here now Who are these who are these secret agents? Dude, like who's this guy in like our driveway, man? Bro, it's me. Listen, I live here now. Dude, you don't live here, man. All right, why have you changed your outfit and your voice? Are you trying to hide from the agents? What are you talking about, dude? So you see the guy in all red. He was the person who picked me up a minute ago. After he picked me up, the secret agents pulled up and he magically like disappeared and he's only came back now with a new voice and a completely new outfit. So something tells me that he's trying to disguise himself from the secret agents. I mean, you're gonna have to do more than put on a mask and a new outfit. How little training have you got to go through as a secret agent to not recognize that? These guys must be rookies. All right, ready? Look at the acceleration on this car. Hold on, wait for it. I'm pulling up to Grove. Can I break in time? <gasps> Just tap the crypt car. Nobody saw a thing. All right, so we just pretty much witnessed something illegal go down. I'm not entirely sure what that guy in the red done, but must have been something pretty serious. Secret agents don't just show up for no reason, you know? I don't know why, but this car kind of seems like it'd be a car that can drive in the ocean. Wait, who's this man? Got the same car as me? Anyway, like I was saying, I don't know why, but it just kind of looks like one of those cars that can drive on water. Maybe that's a strange thing to say, but it is a car from the future, right? I imagine cars from the future being able to fly and drive on the ocean. Now, I know I won't see your comment until after the video, but tell me right now in the comments, what do you think this car will look best in? 
kind of like that orange. But then at the same time, I do kind of like the red. We could do red and orange. Is that going to look too weird though? Um, yeah, nah, that does not look nice. How about all orange? Ooh, okay, I'm convinced that this thing is a UFO now. A UFO with wheels. I don't know why, but the sound it makes at high speed just sounds like something a UFO would make. Now, guys, I've got an uh, area marked out on the map. And it's kind of in the Melrose area. We're going to head down to Vangelico, which, if I remember correctly, is a diamond store. I mean, let's pass by there and see if I could pick me up some new ice, a new chain or something. Look, I can't speed or it spams me with this annoying message. But listen, I don't care. You can spam me. No way. If you guys want, let me know by leaving a like. I can rob this store for like a whole nother video. I think that'd be really cool. Damn, we've got a guard here. These guys are not playing around. All right, we're going to go inside. 9,200. $155 for that tiny little diamond there. Sheesh, this place is expensive. Then we got more rings over here. Oh my god, that looks like the queen's necklace, maybe. Have they just got their cleaner chilling here with a broom out? Wait, shall I try and sneak into this room here? The guard is just kind of looking at me right now, though. Everyone's just walking around way too much. I need everyone to turn around for one second, like right now. There we go. I'm in. We're gonna have to be quiet now. Everyone leave right now. Hello. Sir. Don't hey. leave this room. I just wanted get to out. speak to you in I, here. I just opened up this place. Everyone get out. Everyone out. Yes, get okay, out. I'm, okay, I'm gonna get out. All right, there's nothing nice. special in there anyway. I'm knocking over all the chairs now. <laughs> They're gonna throw me out of Angelico in a sec. My friend, are you uh, looking to buy anything? Yeah, do you have like, I don't know, you got like a $10 million chain? Uh, yes, my friend, I do. Are you the owner? Uh, I'm not the owner, my friend. It's a bit feminine, wouldn't you say? Yeah, yes, it would be perfect for you, my friend. What do you mean, perfect for me? Oh, um, uh, you know, you're very feminine, my friend. And you look like Santa Claus. That's what I was going for. I'm kind of convinced that all the diamonds are plastic, so I'm going to leave now. Hey, no! Um, yeah, it's a, it's a you lost a customer now. It's no! too late. Goodbye. Vangelico is a fraud. All right. Well, we just found out that Vangelico is a fraudulent business. How dare you try and sell me plastic diamonds for 10 mil? Do, 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 do. Yeah, I knew I knew they were selling fake stuff when they had a PC like Why this in here. Shit? You make hey, one of what? our diamonds and then you come back here. <laughs> I'm trying to take the Windows PC. Are you going to let me? Nah, no, do not take it, my friend. This is my PC. <laughs> oh, All right, then. Jesus Christ. I'm trying to come in here undetected and you keep finding me. Don't not tell anyone this, but everything is made out of plastic in here. Oh, so now you guys are admitting it. Yes. Yeah. But do not but only to you. Don't, don't tell anyone, okay? If you tell someone, I'll break your toes. I need my toes. Is the G-Wagon out here plastic too? Yes, oh. it's plastic, my friend. All right, well, those guys were some of the biggest con artists I've ever seen. They're trying to sell plastic to players as diamonds. Wait, are they chasing me now? That's the plastic G-Wagon behind me. Oh no, I'm gonna step on it now. I can see that they're a little bit mad that I found out about their fake business. You know what? If they want to chase me, I'm gonna drive to their store right now and put my futuristic car through their doors. All right, Vangelico, I'm gonna actually drive inside the store. And then wait, if I can maybe blow up my car in here, that will be legendary. This is probably gonna take a couple of minutes to set on fire but i'm gonna do my best i will find you and i will take your toes i just got a message from that crazy man with the beard and the different hair color uh oh hey oh, listen oh what, what are you doing okay get me in the car get me in the car what are you guys doing to me oh uh, we're kidnapping you you stupid bitch Hit my car next time my friend but i just cut off his toes please don't i don't want to have his stubs. stubs okay 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 oh my god there you go i cut off your toes you silly bitch. I'm running. I've only got nine toes. Right, I'm going to run myself back to the Vangelico store and I'm going to continue blowing up my car because there's no way you're going to cut off one of my toes and get away with it. Haha, -ha, I have made it back. This car really needs to explode like now. Oh, we're smoking. I'm going to reposition myself to over here so I can see if someone comes in. Perfect. The car is now on fire. <laughs> That's what you get, bro. And I'm going to shoot at you too. Let me aim down the scope. That guy's dead. There's some more people out here. I don't even know who they are. I'm going to shoot him too, though. Hit him with the left to right, left to right. That's two people dead. Oh, there's a third. Oh, no, there's another one. I need to reload quick. 
Oh, right in the head. That's the man who cut my toe off. I think it's safe to say that we destroyed Vangelico. That's what you get for messing with me. There's this guy just walking in here. He runs straight out when he gets hit with a few bullets. There's new people running in here every second. I don't know how many people are outside right now. I think we've killed like four different people. Big Bank Rolls has been murdered. Oh, we got killed. The glass smashed. Right, this was like a scene from a movie. All right, look guys, you damaged me enough. I'm gonna crawl out of here now no, and no, we will you, never you talk again. No, you're not. You're gonna Please come with me, allow bitch. me to do that, sir. No, you're gonna come with me and then I'm gonna finish you for the last time. No more toes. There's no nothing more time. to be finished. I'm a snail now. All right, I think they've had enough of me now. Look at me being carried around like a kid's toy. Oh, they've got hella blacked out cars here. Um, this does not look like a place I want to be. Hello. Put me down, please. I do not want to die. Please, please do not ignore me, sir. Right, so I'm being taken upstairs in what looks like a construction site. Oh, that is some serious skill right there. Carrying me and climbing a ladder at the same time. Wait, is he gonna throw me off the building? Hey, dude, I think you should let me live now. You've already cut my toe off. Oh, oh, it's fair play. I did cut off two of your toes. Oh, two of them? Uh, yeah. Come down. Are you gonna eat them? What are you gonna do with them? All right, I'm running. These guys are crazy. I've got to go. Right, these guys guys are chasing me. I'm going to hit him with the unexpected turn. Unexpected turn number two. I've got to work out somewhere to run. All right, watch this. This is going to be legendary. Come on. Where are you going, huh? I can hear someone in a car. That is not good. That means he's coming to run me over. I'm going to go up the stairs where he cannot. My IQ is at one million right now. Watch this. They won't expect it. They won't expect it. You won't expect it. Come on. Oh, no. Oh, I'm bleeding. What more do these people want from me. I don't even know where I'm at on the map right now. Let me climb the ladder. Oh, if someone gets hit here, it's not going to be good. I can stop him from getting up the ladder though. Ha ha. Hey, come here. Come on then. <laughs> Bro, how are your hands that fast? Oh, I can't jump up here either. Keep on running. We're never giving up. I'm going to lead this man in circles and then watch. Ready? He's going to come around now. Oh, he tried to cut me off. <laughs> I've had enough of you now. You're going to die. How are they doing these takedowns? Oh, no. His friend is here. Right. I'm going to get down and we're going to run over here to the Lucky Pluckers chicken store. Wait, have they gone? Look at my face. We have been beaten today.